So for you is when AI makes you more efficient, is it more about getting that time back so you can be spending time with family and relaxing? Or is it about making you more efficient at your job so that you can spend more time on the things that really you want to be spending time on within the business? What's what's the balance for you? Yeah, so it's totally uh, personal the way you decide to do it, right? I'm sure people are going to, you know, that, you know, they're somewhat content with the way they live and they enjoy it. They're going to use AI to get the job done and just be over with and... It's kind of like people, or you got the other side of the spectrum where people, like you said, okay, I use AI to, you know, get this stuff out of the way. Now let me focus on the, you know, the important stuff. I would categorize myself more in that second bucket. And of course it's very seasonal, right? When December comes, I definitely want to be in that first bucket. Uh, but, you know, for example, now and everything's kind of going and, and, and blooming, I definitely want to use AI to get the stuff out of the way that would take me 20 hours, now it takes me four um, and then so I can focus on the other stuff. And most of that other stuff is probably going to be sales and business development and creating content and things like that. Um, I think that's the future. That's something I'm definitely getting uh, into more and more. Oh, I'm, I'm creating a plan now. I'm getting married in about like three to four weeks. So I'm not going to start yet because I know that's going to move things around. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, but that's uh, that's definitely in the, in the works. That's fantastic news, Marco. Thanks. Thanks for sharing that with the show, to be fair. Uh, given that, knowledge that you have and, and admittedly non, non kind of non coding non-technical and I, I think there's a lot of people out there that have that same skill set as you now mark or so like we're, we're seeing an era come through where coding isn't necessary anymore um so why would we why would we even want to learn coding because it's not you know computer can do that side of things really well for or what it can't do is the logic and reasoning and translation and thinking and humanizing and emotion side of things which is kind of where you sit in the middle 